Go ahead, just get in front. Okay, what have you thought about this Gonsolin Anderson combo the first time and first two times through? It's been great. Um, I, I think it's just uh, the result of both guys buying in, um, namely uh, Tyler, uh, as far as a different role. Um, Tony came out and threw the baseball much better than I thought the first outing. Uh, fastball velocity good, breaking ball good, incomplete control, and then Tyler came in and uh, gave us four strong innings, uh, just what uh, Tony did, um, incomplete control. Really good stuff tonight. Is there anything specific about those two guys that may, may be a tougher matchup for a team, whether it be like the arm angles? Uh, you know, I, I don't think so. I, I think certainly it's a, it's a right-hander and a left-hander, and Tyler is certainly funky, but uh, both guys uh, throughout their careers have been pretty neutral to left and right-hand hitters. So um, I think at first glance, it, it makes it easier when you see a lineup that's uh, a lot of left-handers, and then you can kind of run a lefty out there. Um, but Tyler's, Tyler's been developing and, and really being a weapon against left, too. Did you see anything that surprised you tonight in Cincinnati? Um, no, no, nothing surprised us. Um, I thought some of those guys that we hadn't seen before, uh, namely Gutierrez, came out through the baseball really well. Uh, we're still trying to learn some of those guys that we haven't seen in the past, but uh, certainly missing India, I don't know how long he's going to be out for, was, was a big loss for them. Are you going to try to keep Tyler and, and Tony together moving forward and, and a little bit more of a defined thing than maybe you thought coming into the year? Um, I think we'll uh, we'll just kind of get to the next one, and, and they'll both have their sides. Uh, the sides are on the same day. Um, I think we know when Tony will start, but I think with Tyler, um, it's gone pretty smoothly up to this point. But to give us a little bit of uh, optionality, I guess, as far as that two-day window, as opposed to just kind of making it a definitive piggyback situation. So I think that we're going to keep that open uh, until we're not, I guess. We had done push, but uh, when uh, Mookie stole second with Gavin up there, was that sort of Mookie's call out Gavin to play the back part down the line, or was that something with the shift over just? Yeah, that was just uh, that was that was Mookie's call. Um, that was yeah, that was Mookie's call. But I will say Gavin is playing tremendous baseball um, on both sides of the ball, really taking good at bats, using all fields, um, running the base as well. So it, it's really fun watching. Gavin kind of put it together right now. Do you think Max was going to try to steal home there? You know what's funny? Uh, he, he said, wouldn't that have been great if I would have stole home on Jackie Robinson tonight? So uh, it did cross his mind. And then I think he realized the foot speed that he, uh, uh, he uh, possesses. So I'm glad he didn't to choose to do that. Coach, um, uh, Jackie's last speech was talking about black managers. And how do you feel about that? Um, well, it, 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 there's certainly, uh, we, we've crossed, uh, we've broken some barriers, um, obviously with Cito, uh, myself and Dusty, but we continue got to do better. Um, but today was just, honestly, it was a special, special day. And to top it off, to see uh, Mrs. Robinson today and to see the, uh, the Players Alliance guys uh, give her that jacket and to spend some time with David, uh, it, it was a really cool night. Trey Turner's sitting streak is up to 26. I'm just wondering, in that streak, does it feel to you like he's just been more steady than spectacular? Just singles here and there rather than big hits like the RBI trip today? Yeah, I think steady is a good way to put it. And uh, I, didn't re I didn't appreciate that hitting streak. Um, wow, it's pretty impressive. Um, it does seem like he's always doing something every night to help us win a ball game, um, whether it be at the bat or playing defense. So. It is nice when you can run and you can create some hits too. Um, so I, I just think that he's doing a nice job of staying above water, um, albeit he has a nice hit, hitting streak going on. But when he gets hot, it's going to be real fun. Coach, have you seen anything in Gavin's approach that has helped him have such a good start to the season? Yeah, I, I think he's really committing to uh, using the whole field. Um, I think that when, when you eliminate one side of the field, you get exposed. And um, he's going line to line, which he did tonight. Um, so he's staying in the strike zone. And uh, he punched his last at bat. But you got to make real good pitch to punch him. And so uh, he's uh, buying into the approach, the plan, and, and his mechanics are right where they need to be. Thank you, guys.